everyone, Julie here. So today I'm launching a new series of videos where we are going to practice together our French pronunciation. So this is a series made for people from their very first day of learning French up to people who are already really fluent, who have perfect grammar, but still struggle with French pronunciation, okay? So the idea is we're gonna read together Le Petit Prince. It does not matter whether you understand what it what was written or not it does not matter because we are going to focus on how we're saying it rather than what we're actually saying okay and the goal is to train your mouth to move properly in order to produce these french sounds which might be a bit different to your native language and to you know activate this kind this kind of muscle memory that will allow us to say those sounds properly, to, to yeah, produce them properly when we are speaking in a conversation, okay? And the second goal is to also associate the spelling of the words to how they sound. So how are we gonna do this? Let me show you. First, I am going to read you the five or six lines, the little paragraph. I'm going to read it uh, normal speed, and then we will focus on one line at a time, and when we focus on one line at a time, you will see some different colors. So some letters will be gray because in this context, they're silent. There are rules on you know, why this or that letter is silent, but I personally find that the best way is to just, again, train this instinct, okay? Create this instinct that you know if a letter is silent or not without even thinking about it. So I'm going to show you which ones are silent and hopefully, naturally, they will become very obvious to you after a while. And then the second thing you will see is um, red underscores between some words. And this means there is a liaison. The liaison is when the last sound of a word extends onto the next one if that verb that word, sorry, starts with a vowel sound. So H in French, in French counts as a vowel sound, okay, because we don't pronounce them. Um, and so here, for example, we see six ans, okay, six ans. If we say, for example, they have, ils ont, okay, so il, we don't pronounce the S when it's on its own or before another word, but before on, which starts with a vowel, we'll say ils ont, okay? So this is the liaison, and this is what will help you to really sound French and also to understand French better if you know this exists, right? So this is what we're going to focus on, and I will read each word, you know, separately, very slowly, read the whole sentence again, and then move on to your next sentence. And when we've done all the sentences, I'll reread the whole paragraph again, normal speed, and I invite you to read after me. So I will leave enough time for you to pause. You will have to pause, okay, between each sentence and repeat it as many times as you need until it sounds like what I'm saying, okay? Um, so I hope this was clear. Uh, if not, please ask me questions in the comments, no problem at all. I will start publishing, sorry, I will start post posting videos today. So this is the introduction video. There is already one video of this exercise online. So go check it out. And uh, then I will post one video per day for a month, the whole month of January. And hopefully by February, we will all have perfect French pronunciation. Uh, so don't forget to subscribe and activate the notification bell. So you will be informed, you will be notified that there is a little pronunciation exercise available for you today or that day. Um, and yeah, I'll see you tomorrow for another exercise. Bye.